Okay, now let us look at CT scan of the head, basically focusing on the brain. Case number 24, a 26 year old gentleman presents with to the ER with sudden onset of headache associated with vomiting, a CT brain is taken. Look at this cut of the CT brain. Can you describe it? What you need to know is a CT brain in the ICU is usually done without contrast and you are going to see three densities. The brightest and most intense white is the bone, the skull. Next to it you will see grey coloured brain parenchyma and in the brain parenchyma what if you see anything black? it is usually the CSF. Any other abnormalities you see within the brain is contrasted with these three shades. Blood is usually white in colour, not as dense as the bone. So, if you see something white within the brain parenchyma, it is blood. The next most common thing that you will see is slighter shade of grey but not black that would be infarct and if you see something black it is usually fluid. With this at the background let us look at this CT brain. Can you identify the parts of the brain? Okay. That which is numbered 1 is the anterior horn of the lateral ventricle. What is number 2? That is the third ventricle, that is part of the basal cistern, that is the cerebellar vermis. Look at this cut of the same patient. What are you seeing here? Identify the structures again. So, that is a CSF fill space. Looking at its position, it looks like the sylvian fissure. The part of the brain which comes next to the sylvian fissure just posteriorly is the temporal lobe. There, again, part of the cistern, basal cistern.